afternoon. How's everybody doing? Me, 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 me. Happy Friday. Good afternoon. Day. What's up, what's up, what's up? Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome again to our Friday afternoon fitness. Hello, I'm Anthony, fitness and sports instructor at CFB Shiloh here in Manitoba. Mm -hmm. So, how are y'all doing? Having a good day? Good build up to the weekend? People are out playing golf now. More people are around town, out and about. Mm hmm. All right, let's give you guys another couple minutes to get settled, get ready for today's workout. You can choose to make it completely body weight, or if you have at your disposal, have a backpack and maybe a weighted vest or some dumbbells to use as resistance for our various exercises. Woo, so, woo. All right. So as we begin, our workout today is a force fitness training session. So we're just doing some exercises gearing you towards having a successful force test whenever it is you're doing it again. All right, so we're just help to helping to build that anticipation for your next force test session. So I'll go through the disclaimer and then we'll get into the details of our workout. So in response to COVID-19, mm -hmm. PSP is offering virtual fitness to Canadian Armed Forces members. By using social media platforms, the virtual fitness classes tailored to Canadian Armed Forces personnel become accessible to all. Participants who are not Canadian Armed Forces members recognize and acknowledge that their age, health status, and physical fitness level are unknown. And it's entirely up to each individual to assess their ability to participate in this class. Since it is preferable to consult your physician before beginning any exercise program, we invite all participants who are not Canadian Armed Forces members to consult the Get Active questionnaire of the Canadian Society of Exercise Physiology and its reference document. If you experience any pain or difficulty during the exercises presented in this video, it is recommended that you stop and consult a healthcare provider. If a calf member or if calf members sustain an injury during this video please remember to fill out a CF 98 form so there's a get active questionnaire and the get active reference document and they are in the they what's up John and they are in the um, description to this video all right so if you need to consult those documents in this time, you can do that. All right, so I'll just go through describing our workout for today, and then we'll get through some demonstrations, our warm-up, and then we'll get right to work. All right. So, first things first, we have five sets of exercises, all right? The majority of them will be superset with another exercise to really build the intensity. Um, first exercise is a set of squats, all right? 
Uh, we'll be using our resistance. If you have a backpack, use that. If you got a weighted vest, you got dumbbells. Um, if you have children there to hold, then hold them. Uh, and we'll be supersetting that with some jumping jacks. All right. Then we'll go to some plank pull-throughs, and we'll superset those with jumping jacks as well. And then we're going to get into some alternating lunges with a bicep curl, and we're going to superset those with some bicycle crunches. And then we're going to get to some toe taps. So if you have a backpack or something you want to put on the floor as a reference, you're going to jump on the spot, tapping back and forth with your feet. Do that for 20 seconds, then we'll rest for 10, then repeat. All right? So there are going to be four sets of every exercise, four rounds total. And we're going to stay at the one exercise for those full four rounds. Then we're going to switch over. All right? And then our last one is going to be thrusters. We're going to use our resistance, backpack, weighted vest, whatever you want, dumbbells. And we'll do thrusters, and then we're going to superset that with bear crawls. So now I'm going to demonstrate what we're expected to do. Then we'll get to our warm-up. So, first things first. So, since we're doing the squats, this time the emphasis is not going to be on pure speed. We're going to focus on time under tension. So, we're going to count three, two, one, pause, one, Two, stand up. Three, two, one, one, two, stand up. So three seconds down, pause for two seconds at the bottom, and then stand up. And go back and forth in there. So we do 30 seconds of squats like that. After that, 10 seconds for jumping jacks right here. And then rest for 20 seconds. Then we repeat those squats. After that, we're going to do take your resistance here. And we're going to do some plank pull-throughs. So, set up in a high plank or a push-up plank. Simply, nice and tall. You're going to take that resistance, pull it underneath your body, across, as far as it's comfortable. And then repeat. The other side, pull across, and repeat. Alright, do 30 seconds of work there. You're going to stand up. 10 seconds of jumping jacks. Rest for 20 seconds never repeat all right if when you're doing your pull through if that motion reaching under and across if that's uncomfortable simply focus on holding a plank here either in your push-up high plank position here or bring yourself down to your forearms whichever one is most comfortable all right also feel free if it's comfortable or you want more challenge you can come down to a side plank too you can switch to the other side find a way that you can control the best in a way that will challenge you. All right? Next set, we're going to get our resistance, resistance again in hand. It's going to be a reverse lunge. So we're going to simply reverse or forward lunge. So you're going to step back. And as you step back, you're going to curl it, doing a bicep curl, stand up. Switch feet, step back, bicep curl, stand up. So lunge and curl, switch feet, lunge and curl. After you finish that, which will be for a total of 40 seconds, you're gonna stop there, come to the floor on your back, and we do some bicep, or sorry, bicycle crunches, 20 seconds here. We'll rest for 30 seconds, and then we'll repeat, okay? so. Alternating lunges, remember, you can also go forward if you want. So lunge forward and bicep, bicep curl, switch feet, forward, bicep curl. If the resistance isn't comfortable, drop the weight if you want to. Put that on the floor or you can just hold the weight simply and lunge. If that's more comfortable, you can also put it on your back and simply focus on the lunge there. All right, next set of exercises, try to work on a bit of your foot speed. So, we're gonna do some toe taps. So here, I'm my backpack, and simply for 20 seconds, on the spot, you're gonna switch toes tapping onto whatever surface you have. If you don't have 
something to put on the floor there, get a pillow, get some shoes, something like that. Put them on the floor, tap, tap for 20 seconds. We'll rest for 10, and we'll come back another 20 seconds, rest for 10. And again, we have four sets of that. All right, last part we have going back to the squats, but we're doing thrusters this time. All right. Now with this one, get your resistance in hand here. Simply gonna squat down with the resistance, squat, stand up, press it overhead. All right, squat, press up, squat, press up. I can't press too high because the ceiling is literally right there. But I'm sure your ceilings aren't so low, so press away. All right, so we do those thrusters, 20 seconds, squat and press. Then we go down to the floor and we do bear crawls, working on coordination. So on all fours, get your shoulders over the wrists, hips over your knees, and simply you take two steps forward, two steps back. All right, so get your knees just off the ground. One, two, one, two. So you're gonna alternate left leg, right foot, right foot, left leg, and then back, all right? And then that'll be 20 seconds there. Then we'll take a break, 30 seconds, and then we'll repeat again. Again, four sets for each one. And that will be our workout. Let me know if you got any questions. All right, let's get into our warm up, and then we'll begin. All right, so where we are right now, get those heels up, walking on the spot, do some butt kicks as we're here. Now to loosen up the legs a bit more, start jogging on the spot. Again, lift those legs up. Get those heels up, wake up those legs. All right, slow back down. Next thing we do, loosen up quads, hamstrings a bit more. So, high knee, hug to your chest, drop down, sweep the floor. Switch feet, high knee, hug to your chest, foot down, sweep the floor. Switch. Sweep, knee hug, foot down, sweep. Knee hug, foot down, sweep. Knee hug, foot down, sweep. One more time on each side, hug that knee, sweep. Last time, hug that knee, and sweep. All right, gonna wake up those ankles a bit from here. One foot on top of the toes here. On the balls of the feet, you're gonna rotate to the inside. Rolling on the balls of the feet five times. Five circles going to the inside. Pause there. Five circles going to the outside. Kind of wake up those ankles a bit. Get ready for some dynamic movement. All right. Go the other foot five times, going to the outside. Pause there, five times to the inside. And again, just on your toes, front of the balls of the feet. All right. Now from here, you're gonna wake up your calves a bit more. So get into downward facing dog. One foot on top of the, on the toes, the balls of the feet. One foot flat, as flat as you can get it. And we'll switch. Rock back, forth, back, forth. Five more times. One, two, three, four, five, and let's rest. Stand back up as we're here. Wake up our upper body, arms out wide. High five, your back. Switch which arm is on top. Crisps and cross. Sweep all across the body. Open up as much as you can. Now from here. Do some forward arm circles. So again, arms as wide as you can. Start slow, start small. Make some circles going forward. Gradually get bigger. Now make as big of a circle as comfortable. 
and relax there. Switch to the other side. Going backwards now. Again, start small. Gradually getting bigger. Open up. Slowly getting bigger again. All right. And again, all you need for this workout is access to some water, some form of resistance. I'm using my, a backpack for today. If you have weighted vests, you got dumbbells, by all means use that. All right, so give you guys another minute. Let me grab some water. All right, getting into more of a squatting warm up. Get you guys into a nice wide squat stance. Reach for those toes. Squat down, toes, and let's stand. Three more, toes, squat down, toes, stand. Two more, toes, squat, toes, stand. Last one, toes, squat, toes, stand. Okay. And remember, we have five sets of exercises and due to copyright restrictions, I can't play any music on my end, but feel free to play music for yourself. All right, give another 30 seconds and we shall begin. So, we are starting with our squats. Grab your resistance. Remember, we're going from squats for 30 seconds and then 10 seconds of jumping jacks. All right? So let's get ready to move. Remember, three seconds down, two seconds holding, one second to stand up. So three, two, one, let's begin. Three, two, one, one, two, and let's stand. Three, two, one, one, two, stand. Three, two, one, one, two, stand. Three, two, one, ten seconds to go. One, two, stand. Let's keep going. Three, two, one, one, stand. Those jumping jacks. At 10 seconds here. Three, two, one. Let's rest. All right. So it's nice and easy. Nice and easy there. First two rounds will make it nice and simple. We'll step it off the last two. Make sure you have some fun with it. All right. Back again. 30 seconds squatting here. And let's begin. Three, two, one, let's pause. One, two, stand up. Three, two, one, pause. Two, stand up. Three, two, one, one, two, stand up. Three, two, one, one, two, stand up. Now let's get back to our jumping jacks. Only 10 seconds here. All right, let's rest. All right, for our last two rounds, we're gonna go up to 40 seconds on our squats and then 20 seconds on our jumping jacks, all right? 10 seconds will start. So get ready, five seconds, three, two, one, let's begin, three, two, one, pause, one, two, three, two, one, pause, one, two, three, two, one, pause, one, two, three, two, one, pause, one, two. If this isn't comfortable, you can simply stick to regular pace for squats. 
three, two, one, pause, one, two, stand up. Now to our jumping jacks, 20 seconds here. second break here and we go to our last round try to keep those legs loose just try to breathe and move at the same pace five seconds and then we get to our last round and let's begin three Two, one, pause, one, two. Three, two, one, pause, one, two. <laughs> Three, two, one, pause, one, two. Three, two, one, pause, one, two. Three, two, one, pause, one, two. Two. Now let's get back to our jumping jacks. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Let's rest. We have a minute to recover now. <sighs> Grab some water if you need it. Remember next exercise. We're here doing our plank pull through. It's a high plank. Pull the sandbag or whatever resistance you have backpack across underneath your body. If you need to, just hold a static plank instead. Extended here, straight on the palms or down to the forearms or again in the side plank. Your choice there. And we will begin in three, two, one, and let's go. It's 30 seconds here. Then we're going to superset with our jumping jacks. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Let's up to our jumping jacks. Let's rest. 30 second break. And we will go again. Let me know how you feel. We're getting there. We're getting there. All right, 10 seconds, we go again. Three, two, one, and let's begin. Round two here. <laughs> 10 seconds. Three, two, one. 10 seconds here. Jumping jacks. Let's 
rest. All right, another 30 second break here. All right, now like our first exercise, we step this one up and we'll give you 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds to rest. Sorry, 40 seconds plank pull through, 20 seconds on your jumping jacks. Five seconds, three, two, one, and let's go. Let's take the time with it. Try to pace yourself a bit. Got 40 seconds of work here. Try to keep your feet wide. Give you better balance. If you want more of a challenge, bring them in closer. <laughs> 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Let's get up. Back. Jumping jacks. 20 seconds here. Three, two, one. Five more seconds. <laughs> and let's rest. All right, 30 second break. Whew, so how y'all feel? Starting to get a little sweaty right now. All right. Last set coming up here. Five seconds, three, two, one, and let's go. 40 seconds here. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to our jumping jacks. Three, two, one. Let's take a break. Grab some water. All right, two exercises down, three to go. All right. <laughs> See you, Jenna. Feeling good too. Feeling good. <laughs> All right, so for this set of exercises here, it's our toe taps. So like for me, using my backpack, go for 20 seconds, tap. Think of like Dance Dance Revolution, but maybe not as entertaining, all right? So toe taps. Just joking, I skipped the order. We're actually doing the reverse lunges to our bicep curl. So, grab your resistance. So lunges, you step forward and curl, or you step back and curl. Your choice, either way, switch legs each time. All right. So you got 40 seconds there, the lunges and bicep curl and then 20 seconds on our bicep or our bicycle crunches. All right, we'll begin 
five seconds. Three, two, one, and let's go. Lunge, curl. Switch feet. We're here for 40 seconds. Take your time with it. Ten seconds. And let's switch. Let's go to bicycle crunches on our back. Ten seconds. Let's rest. Thirty second break. Remember, if it's not comfortable, don't worry about the resistance. Just focus on the lunges. And if you're not comfortable curling at the same time, just focus on doing the lunges. Or if you want, do a few curls to start or to finish, and then just do a few lunges and go back and forth that way. All right, so set number two, and three, two, one, and let's go. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Let's switch. So bicycle crunches. <laughs> Make sure y'all can see me. Three, two, one. Let's rest. Another 30 seconds. We're getting there. Two more sets. 10 seconds. Back to our lunges. Three. Two, one, and let's go. Fifteen seconds. Doing good. Three, two, one. Back. It's our favorite exercise here.
three, two, one, let's rest. <sighs> Thirty second break again. We're getting there. One more set. Three, two, one, and let's go. Five seconds. Let's go back. Bicycle crunches last time. Let's rest. <laughs> Let me know if you're sweating it. All right. Take a break here. Give you guys a minute. Then we get into our toe taps. There's no superset for this one. It's just strictly 20 seconds tapping, 10 second break, and repeat. All right? So, four consecutive sets like that. Then we'll rest and get to our last set, our last exercise cluster. Let me know how you guys feel. All right, 30 seconds. Ten seconds. Let's get ready to go. Five, four, three, two, one, and begin. Just twenty seconds here. Use your arms. Get a bit of extra speed. Three, two, one. Let's rest. Three, two, one, let's go. Keep breathing. Five seconds. Rest halfway. Let's get ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Trying to get that foot speed up in anticipation of your 20 meter rushes. Five seconds. Rest. One more time. Three, two, 
one, let's go. Three, two, one, let's rest. Whew. Get some water if you need it. set for exercises here. We're combining thrusters and bear crawl. So 20 seconds of thrusters. So get a resistance of choice. Hold it in front of you. Simply squat down, stand up, press it overhead, and then squat, press it overhead. So 20 seconds there. Then you get rid of your weight onto all fours. Knees just off the ground into bear crawl. So two steps forward, two steps back. All right. Again, four sets of that. All right. This time when we do it, it's me back and forth in that manner, but we'll rest for 30 seconds in between each one. Sorry, in between each superset. So thrusters, 20 seconds, right into bear crawl for 20 seconds, rest for 30, then we'll repeat. All right, five seconds, we'll begin. Three, two, one, and let's go. So here are the thrusters. Switch, press the bear crawl. Try to keep your knees low to the ground without touching the ground. <laughs> Forgot you couldn't see me. Let's rest. Thirty second break here. And back for our thrusters. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. If overhead is uncomfortable, simply squat. Press it in front, or just hold it to your body. Or switch between all of them. Switch to our bear crawls. rest two more sets left let me know how you feel all right going back to our thrusters three two one, let's go. Switch, get to our bear crawls again. Let's 
rest. One more time. Just one more time. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Switch, bear crawls. rest Whew. doing good been rest here for one minute and what we'll do next is a superset of all of our exercises so a giant set of every exercise back to back to back all right starting with the squats now to the plank pull-throughs. Only thing we're gonna skip is the little cardio portions, okay? So no jumping jacks, we'll skip that. All right. <coughs> so exercise, 10 second break, next exercise, all right? Every exercise is going to be at 30 seconds this time. Be nice and fun. Five, four, three, two, one. And let's squat away. Two, one. Two. Five seconds. All right, let's rest. Ten second break. Three, two, one, and let's go. Plank pull through. Five seconds. Let's rest. So we do our lunges and our bicep curls. Three, two, one, let's go. Three, two, one, let's rest. Got our toe taps next. Three, two, one, let's go. It's all 30 seconds here. Ten seconds. Let's 
Thrust. Thrusters. Three, two, one, and let's go. Five seconds, three, two, one, rest for 10. Got a bear crawl next, three, two, one, and let's go. Ten seconds. And let's rest. Whew. How are you guys feeling? We're done. <laughs> Grab some water. Walk around a bit. Slow down your breathing. Take nice deep breaths. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. All right, keep slowing down your breathing. Drink some water. Good way to kick off the Friday evening. All right. Last few moments here. Get your kneeling, stretch out a bit. So, have kneeling stance here, front leg. Keep a slight bend in that knee. Bring that chest over the knee. If it's comfortable, you can extend that leg. Get this knee straight. You feel a bit of a greater stretch going through the hamstrings now. Start to recruit your calves a bit. Curl those toes back toward your shin. You can reach them, reach them, pull them back even further if it's comfortable. Still focus on your breathing. Nice and controlled. And we'll switch to the other side. Again, leg extended in your half kneeling stance. Either keep a slight bend in this knee if this is the most suitable range of motion for you or straighten that leg out at the knee and continue to lean forward. Feel that stretch through your hamstring, getting into your calves as well. Keep curling those toes back. Keep relaxing, slowing down that breathing. All right, and relax while we're here. We're gonna stretch out. Start right here, your quad. So staying here if it's comfortable. In your half kneeling stance, grab that leg behind you, pull it up, as you stay there as upright as is comfortable. So press your hips forward, get a more dynamic stretch in the hip flexor. And if it's more comfortable, you can also lie down on your side and stretch your quad from there. And let's relax, we'll switch to the other side. Same thing here, grab the back leg, pull that leg behind you. 
You can either lean forward here or try to bring yourself up straight as you pull your leg behind you. You can rest your arm on your leg like I'm doing right now or we'll bring it to the floor for more balance if you need that. Still focusing on our breathing. We should be a bit more comfortable now in the breathing aspect. Right, relax there. Bring you down to seated position here. Cross one leg over the other. Now you're gonna hug that knee in to your body. Try to sit up as tall as is comfortable. Turn into that side. I have my right knee up. So I'm turning into my right side. If your left knee is up, turn to the left. Feel a stretch coming through your glutes on the side that you're turning to. All right, relax. Let's go to the other side. Again, cross the leg over. Hug that knee in. Get nice and cozy. Again, try to bring that leg in as tight as you can to your body. And relax. Through here, get one arm out across chest, pull that arm in tight to your chest, stretch that shoulder, try to relax that arm, again focusing on your breathing, just relax, just switch sides. downward facing dog. As you hear, cross one ankle over the other, starting up on the toes, slowly bring that one leg, bouncing leg to the floor, try to get the heel onto the floor, try to keep your foot flat, really press your hands into the floor, anchor them there, feel that stretch going through your calf. Relax those shoulders, switch sides, same on the other side, start on the toes, and drop that foot as close to the floor as possible. Try to get as comfortable as you can. Relax. Whew. All right. Thank you all again for attending. Thanks for participating. See you again same time next week. Until then, keep fit and have fun. And enjoy your weekend. Take it easy.